The viscoinjector is a manually operated device for precision delivery of small amounts of viscoelastic fluid. The scrub nurse or technician is responsible for operating the viscoinjector from the sterile field. A cartridge of viscoelastic is placed into the body of the viscoinjector. The body of the viscoinjector connects to the handle of the viscoinjector. The viscoinjector can be used with the ProVisc, Helon Pro and Helon GV Pro. The knob of the viscoinjector is rotated clockwise to deliver viscoelastic fluid. The viscoinjector connects to the iTruck Advance canaloplasty device via an infusion line. To prepare the probisc, pull the rubber cap from the end of the syringe and discard. Remove the green plunger rod from the syringe by rotating it counterclockwise until it becomes disconnected from the rubber plunger. Once disconnected, pull the green plunger rod away from the syringe and discard. Inside the tray you will find the viscoinjector body, the viscoinjector handle, the black fibre optic cable and the clear infusion line. Insert the cartridge of viscoelastic through the side of the body. You will hear an audible click as the cartridge is properly inserted. Connect the handle to the body, securing the cartridge of viscoelastic in place. Rotate the knob clockwise to advance the plunger until it contacts the rubber stopper in the cartridge of viscoelastic. The viscoinjector is now assembled. Remove the clear infusion line from the tray and firmly attach the lure connector to the viscoinjector. To prime the eye track advance, rotate the knob of the viscoinjector clockwise. Continue rotating the knob until viscoelastic flows from the tip of the microcatheter. Approximately eight full rotations of the knob will be required. When the black line on the knob aligns with the black line on the handle, this indicates one full revolution or eight clicks. Viscoelastic fluid is delivered during withdrawal of the iTruck Advanced Microcatheter from Schlem's Canal to perform viscodilation, as directed by the surgeon. Viscoelastic fluid can also be delivered during intubation to overcome blockages or occlusions in Schlem's Canal, as directed by the surgeon. During viscodilation, the surgeon will slowly withdraw the iTruck Advanced Microcatheter through Schlem's Canal while the scrub nurse or technician operates the viscoinjector to deliver viscoelastic fluid. To deliver viscoelastic fluid, gently hold the viscoinjector and rotate the knob in small increments or clicks. The simultaneous withdrawal of the iTruck Advanced Microcatheter and delivery of viscoelastic fluid via the viscoinjector must be smooth, consistent and continuous.